So I'm here raising money for my foundation, Shane Gray Foundation, and this is why. Let me introduce you to my family here in Kenya. I've got three sisters, Ruth, Dorcas, and Victoria. And then there's my mom, Agnes. I love my family and what they have done for me since I arrived in Kenya, I will never forget. And that's why with your help, I built a chicken shed so that Agnes would be the first beneficiary of my foundation. Ah, happy birthday. Well, I'm looking to you for help again. I want to raise enough money to build my family a proper house so I can empower my family and allow them the opportunity. Ruth, say my sauce. Why am I here in beautiful Kenya and why am I with this beautiful family? Well, it's a long story, but I met a guy many years ago at my hometown of Owensboro, Kentucky, who invited me then to Kenya because he was from Kenya, but it was too early for me. Then he reconnected with me years later and said, man, Shane, you should come to Kenya. Well, I did. And when I did, I met this beautiful family and this is now my home. Well, good morning. Habadi asabui. Kuja. Come inside my room. This is where I've been staying for the last year and a half here in Chuka. It may not be what you're probably used to back in America, but here it's definitely been my place of comfort for the last year and a half. Just outside my door, I actually have our cow, which is named Lucky. So let's go find Victoria, Dorcas, and Ruth. Hey! hey! Ooh. So this is your home, yeah? So Dorcas, what would it mean to you having a new home? I'm so happy. Yeah. Because it's our house. What would it mean to you to have your own home? I would be so happy if we have our own house, a big one. Why would it make you happy? Because we're in our own house. Okay. And it would be a great thing. You can do anything you want. You have enough space. Are you ready to show us where you stay? Yeah. Well, let's go find out where you sleep. Where do you sleep, Ruth? Mm -hmm. Huh? Bedroom. Show me. Let's go. So this is your bedroom? Yeah. yeah. Wow. So where do you sleep, Dorcas? Yeah. You sleep in the big bed? Oh, you sleep yeah. in this bed? Yeah. Victoria, where do you sleep? Uh, probably I sleep on the cushion because we are, we are too many. <laughs> too many people. <laughs> yeah. Ruth, where do you sleep? You sleep with Mama? Yeah? Wow. So come on, let's go find Agnes. Hey, Agnes! Yes, hey. You're cutting my favorite greens. Yes. Hey, everyone, this is Agnes. Yes. The mother of those three amazing kids, a pillar in this community, and a pillar in my life. If it was not for Agnes, I would have been gone a long time ago through all the challenges I had to go through here. She encouraged me from day one. So how long have you been here? I have been here for 13 years. 13 years on this compound. Yeah. yeah which is amazing, living in that bedroom that we just saw. Yeah. Yeah. So what would it mean to you to have your own house? I'll be able to live a good life in my compound, to do a lot of work so that I can help the Ninde. Which will be amazing because the house will be there on, on the foundation site. Yeah. Which will be pretty amazing, you being on the site. Yes. And not have to walk all the way over yeah, all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you're ready to have your own house. Yes, I'm ready to have my own house. <laughs> Not only do I feel it's my responsibility to help build my family a house, but they are also so important for the Shane Gray Foundation. This family represents my vision. They're actually the reason I chose Kenya. So here we are. Uh, it's the chicken farm, obviously. And this is the house right here, where this is the site of the Shane Gray Foundation and the site of Agnes's and the kids' future home. Here it is. The more sustainable and empowered families my foundation can create within the community of Chuka, then my work will deliver and inspire real development for this nation. Any financial help you can give through a donation will help the Shane Gray Foundation complete this house for my family, and that will embody the passion and dedication of my work. So with your support, I was able to get the chicken farm complete. 
With your support, I got my chicken restaurant complete. Now with your support, we can get this house complete and put this family that I've known for almost two years here in Kenya into their first home so that Agnes can be here on site at the Shangri Foundation helping me with all the projects here. And we would love to see them in their first home. Thank you. Awesome. Asante. Asante.